Hey guys, and welcome to a skier task guide, Golden Swag. For this task, you're going to need to find the Gilded Zero Lighter, and then you're going to need to sash the Gilded Zero Lighter in the bunkhouse in the trailer park on customs. Get to leave a like on this video if you find this guide useful. So when it comes to getting the Dorm Room 303 key, this is actually a very common key, and I'd be very surprised if you haven't found it by now. It spawns in pockets as well as in the bags of scavs extremely commonly as well as when it comes to the um, jackets that are dotted around the map this is definitely one of the most common keys that you are going to find if you kill 10 scavs i'll guarantee that you do find this key but if you do want a more in-depth video i do actually have a full key guide for this key and now when it comes to the trailer park portable cabin key Skier will actually send you this key once you have collected the task or started the task so make sure you check your messages from Skier so it's an easy collection. If you happen to have lost this key it does spawn in the pockets and bags of scavs as well as in jackets and you will be in dorms anyway so it'll be a easy enough grab if you are going to need it. If not both of those keys are very cheap on the flea market as you will now be around the level where you've unlocked the flea. So here on the map, you can see two highlighted zones where you're going to pick up the item and then drop off the item. We're actually going to be the one at the dorms, not on the far left side, but which is where we're going to pick up the item. Just like so, we are here at dorms right now. On the left is three-story dorms, and this is the building you're going to want to enter. Go through the main entrance and then go up the flight of stairs until you're up at the very top like so. What you're going to want to do is turn right. By the way, just be careful that the shadow isn't here. And also watch out for PMCs because this is a high traffic location. This is the door right here. As you can see, 303 right there. Unlock the door just like so. And once it's unlocked, you're going to see this little golden thing next to the candles. All you need to do is actually head over to the portable cabin that I'm going to be showing you in just a minute. If you happen to die between the transit from this area, which is dorms over to the portable cabin, you do have to come and collect the item again. You don't need to do it in the same raid, so you can um, collect the item and then bugger off and then come back um, on your next raid and hope you get a good spawn for the portable cabin. That isn't an issue. You just cannot die between the process of picking up the item and dropping it off in the portable cabin, unless you transfer it to your offline stash, but anyway. And now for the second location as you can see on the map we're on the far left side which is the custom side over there is the big red building over there is actually the trailer park extract and you can see the train right there and just over that train is actually the river so we are at the trailer park just like so it is the gated area on the bottom part of the map and this is the cabin right here that you're going to need the key for just unlocking this door i will just say what you should do or what i'd recommend that you do is actually you come in here and actually close the door and just crouch here whilst you're looking at the door and place the item as it does take around about 30 seconds to actually place once you've placed the actual item though if you die after you've placed it you don't need to worry so it's all fine and dandy skier doesn't care if you survive or not he is quite ruthless like that if you are struggling with this task or just in general wanting to find people to play with, head over to prana.tv slash discord. We do have a decently large looking for group community as well as a Sherpa system. So if you just need a bit more help than normal, then we are there to help you. Hopefully you guys found this guide useful. If you did, don't forget to leave a like and subscribe or possibly consider joining the channel membership where you can unlock early videos as well as a few custom rewards. Don't forget to check out Piranha.tv as well. That's a one-stop shop for all of your guides, tasks, keys, all those kind of things in one location. Hopefully you guys found this guide useful and I'll see you in the next video. And a big thank you to all of my Patreons supporting me over on patreon.com slash Piranha TV. And a huge thank you to Jay Dam, Freddy and Beansy. Without this kind of support, I wouldn't be able to do what I do.